Hi, welcome to lesson two, where we are going to talk about the nutrient levels of the different fodder crops discussed in the previous lesson. So we are going to look at both the energy fodder crops and the protein fodder crops. Energy is measured in megajoules of metabolizable energy per kilogram, and protein levels are measured in percentage crude protein. So let's look at the first category the energy fodder crops. And we are going to focus on the six major energy fodder crops grown in Kenya. Namely, maize for silage, napier grass, fodder sorghum, rose grass, kikuyu grass, and fodder oats. Maize silage has an energy value of 10.8. Napier grass has a value of 7.0. Fodder sorghum has an energy value of 9.0. Rhodes grass has an energy value of 7.0. Kikuyu grass has an energy value of 9.5. And finally, Ford Outs, which has an energy value of 10.0. Let's now look at the second category, the protein fodder crops. And you are going to look at the five major protein fodder crops grown in Kenya, namely Lusan also known as alfalfa, desmodium, which comprises of the green leaf and silver leaf, lupins, which also comprises of the sweet and bitter lupins, and finally, papovich. Lusan has an average of 20% crude protein. Desmodium has an average of 18% crude protein. Lupins has an average of 30%. And finally, papovich, which has an average of 17% crude protein. It is also very important to know that these values are only achieved when the good agricultural practices and the right harvesting stage for each fodder crops are observed. Thank you for watching and join me in our next lesson where we are going to discuss the good agricultural practices in maize silage production.